Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Phantom Strategies. So, I want to do an update on Bitcoin. Um, right now, overall market is selling off, and Bitcoin is at um, 3,430, uh, down about 3%. Uh, so, I want to just bring you a quick update on Bitcoin and uh, the overall market. All right. So, before we get it started, if you're new to the channel, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit those notification and the bell icon so you can get this content right away. And if you think these videos are helping you with your trading, with your investing, then please do give me a thumbs up. That really means a lot and keeps me motivated in doing this video content uh, for you guys. All right. Um, so if you refer back to my previous video on Bitcoin, I mentioned that we are coming near this apex um, and it can easily break down uh, because we had a lot of upper resistance that we have to uh, you know clear through and if we don't clear through those resistance it will be easy to break down of um, uh, breakdown of this uh, the sideway pattern that we have been seeing and uh, you know it's it's one of those things that if you don't uh, if there's not enough momentum on the upside you will see people start pulling the money out and uh, that will the the pull out of that money will start uh, causing the wider sell-off because then you will know that there is some machine trading that is going on that is also will trigger and you know that will cause like you know it's, it's a combination of few th things it's not just one factor it's a combination of few things all right so that's exactly what happened that uh, now we are below the support um, um, that we are seeing uh, previously uh, we are coming near like you know um, some price level support but again um, uh, if, if the bulls cannot recapture the lost territory that they have or get over uh, the previous support lines it will be hard for uh, bulls to like you know um, to fight back because it uh, you know the momentum on the downside will start you know getting uh, bigger and bigger and then we will yeah we will be able to retest the lows which was around 31 3200 in Bitcoin uh, and that's a very possible scenario if, uh, if the bulls are not able to recoup some of the lost territory um, in the last few days um, so that's something that to keep in mind and we do need to obviously like just uh, you know clear a lot of the hurdles that we have uh, from the moving averages from the 50 day to 20 day moving average so that something that needs to be you know um, needs to get through uh, sooner rather than later uh, let's look at the bigger like time frame this was a daily let's look at weekly real quick now on the weekly let me zoom in a little bit so we had this down um, massive downturn in the weekly uh, you know the sideway action with doji like which is an indication of like indecision um, I can easily see Bitcoin like ter uh, touching the 200 day moving average which is around uh, 3300 um, that's that is a very possible scenario and I bounce back from that moving average in the previous instance we have uh, we have seen that so I won't be surprised if it comes down to those level and then perhaps bounce but like you know the conviction from the from the bull side is not that good right now um, in all, all honesty like there is not enough con conviction on the on the buying power people who are buying they're simply buying for the trading It's more of a trader rather than investor that I see in in the market right now and you know rightly so because uh, because the type of market that we are in you know it's um, people are like you know uh, getting more and more educated on how they should like be doing their trading like what kind of market we are in so it's it's you know so uh, people are getting adapted to the market people are like you know putting uh, you know money into the bot trading and all those things but uh, I'm not a big advocate of bot trading I'm not a bit of advocate of machine trading because uh, I it's a very um, is one of those things that like the returns always going to be average uh, compared to like you know compared to the market because if everybody start getting them like you know uh, overall if you look at your return for the bot trading it will be very average um, so like you know instead of that the best scenario or best um, approach would be like you know learning from like how this pattern art adapt into the market making sure that your 
applying your risk uh, management strategies and those are some key things that you need to really do in your trades all right um, so do keep that in mind let's just look at the monthly um, all right so this is the monthly we are coming at the end of uh, month of uh, january so and we have been in this uh, downtrend for a quite a while now if you if you count this we have been in the down channel from like a month of august september uh, october november december and now it's going to be january so there will be it's going to be tough. I mean, I'm more optimistic on the upside for the longer view because it's been it's going to be hard for um, uh, for the, you know, for the bears to keep on pushing lower because it's just right now we are uh, quite significantly like, you know, away from the moving average. If I like um, if I look at the monthly moving average, right? So price range from the current price of 3400 and going up to like you know the 20 day moving average that's a almost 94% you know difference 94% difference from the current trading price to only 20 day moving average that is a significant difference um, even for the monthly chart so it, it tells you that the things have been sold too much too fast um, and you know it will be hard to keep on pushing it lower but that doesn't mean that it cannot happen one thing that I have previously said on this channel is a market can stay uh, irrational longer than you and I can stay rational all right so remember that what it means that you know it will do it won't uh, you know it won't give you any logic why it's completely oversold and it's not turning around or why it was completely overbought when we were hitting 20,000 and it wasn't selling off right so those are the things that like you know market will stay long it can stay longer or like you know it can stay irrational much longer than you or I can stay rational right so please do keep that in mind uh, just because um, these are all guides all right this technical studies everything that you're I'm showing you is trading guide trading guys guides are just like you know it's like a sign on highway right if you're let's say if you're driving on a highway and the speed limit is 65 um, that's a guide that okay 65 you can go 75 you can go 85 no one will stop you but you can get into a crash right so those are it's a guide it's up to you if you want to follow it or not um, so um, you know trying to simplify things but uh, hopefully that is um, that is helping you um, with some learning and like you know some uh, trading aspect in your um, in your own personal trading all right uh, so just to recap uh, again uh, if we need uh, the bulls really have to make a case uh, otherwise you know it's gonna be hard uh, uh, for like you know for them to turn around for near term and we can easily see uh, 3200 3000 um, in Bitcoin fairly soon all right um, overall month of february I'm, I'm 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 optimistic but like you know just staying optimistic doesn't like really you know do you anything you know you have to be realistic as well so um we need to make sure that you know there uh, we need some data uh, positive data in order to like you know really put where um, you know uh, put our money where our mouth is right so um so until then i will then i'm on sideline i'm not trying to jump in and just like let the market figure it out um then you know if there's a clear indication then i will try to start making a smaller trades okay that's um so that's pretty much from me right now and i will see how um, if there's any you know you know recouping or like you know regaining the previous level and see how how we are uh, trading from there uh, until then i will just sit on my hand and uh, just look at the market all right talk to you soon